Imagine stepping onto land that drifts across a lake or river. Floating islands aren't just legends, they're real, and they're reshaping what we know about ecosystems. Some, like the Uros Islands in Peru's Lake Titicaca, are woven by hand from reeds and have supported entire communities for centuries. Others, like the massive mats in Africa's Lake Victoria or Bangladesh's Char Islands, form naturally from tangled vegetation, mud, and roots. These islands are hotspots of biodiversity. Unique plants thrive here, creating habitats for rare birds, amphibians, and insects. Some islands move with the wind and water, carrying their mini ecosystems along. Their ability to filter water and absorb pollutants helps purify their surroundings, acting as nature's floating water treatment plants. Even in extreme environments, floating islands can survive droughts and floods, making them resilient marvels of adaptation. Scientists are now studying these islands to learn how they can inspire green solutions for future cities. Floating islands prove that life finds extraordinary ways to flourish, sometimes even while adrift.